Oh, Hawk House, just tell the status right now of uh, your health and, and, and you know, uh, are you able to work out here during the summer workouts and yeah. uh, without any pain and full speed and all that? Yeah, I'm, I'm able to go full speed. I just got clear last week by Dr. Saboni to, you know, get back out here and get with the guys, run routes. But, uh, you know, as far as um, I got to get back to the training staff, so right now they just want to you know, keep me, you know, doing what I'm doing now and just, you know, monitor it a little more and just still be cool for so I can just go into camp fresh. So. See, I mean, in a way, I mean, because you, you've missed so much, it's just kind of like you're you're getting a fresh start here and kind of starting over. But at the same time, you've been here long enough to be able to have learned the playbook and have been around the coaches. So you, you, you got to feel pretty comfortable at this point. Uh, I'm, I'm real comfortable, um, especially with all the time I put in, you know, this off season on the in the film room uh, yeah. with Matt throwing with him and just you know in the weight room and you know coming up into this season, I just feel like I'm you know I'm very prepared. And as far as your role as a receiver, you, there's nobody on this team that you know, can play the role that you can. Uh, is that something that you talk about with Matt, that, that you know, you're the kind of guy that may be able to do some stuff like Michael Floyd does at Notre Dame? I, I mean, that's the way I feel. Um, that's the way my, my role is. I feel like you know, my size and athleticism, not too many guys can do it. But that's just something I've been blessed with. But, you know, me and Matt always talk about it, the role that I have to play in me being a playmaker, that's all I have to do. Now, as, as far as, as, as injuries are concerned, uh, uh, are there any exercises that the doctors are prescribing for you to avoid future injuries? Uh, well, the injuries that I have had since I've been here was, you know, the hamstring, which is, you know, that's preventable. That's just, you know, yeah. added stretching. And um, uh, the groin was something that was, you know, that's preventive that I've been working on real hard with my trainers, trainers uh, Drew and Russ and them, and got my hips, you know, hip flexors stronger. That's not a problem anymore. But the foot injury was something I couldn't control. And um, that was just, you know, uh, you know, unfortunate for that to happen to me. So, but right now I feel like I've been working hard on um, everything outside of my injuries so I can be, you know, healthy. So I've been working on that every day. You guys look like you, you, you're really enjoying being around each other. I mean, it seems like everybody on the team enjoys being around each other. You guys are having fun, and now you have an incoming, a new group of guys coming in, and it just seems like they all feel like they're accepted. And you feel like, I mean, even though you're relatively a young player here, yeah. you feel like it's kind of a role of yours to, to, to make them feel welcome and comfortable yeah. and help I them mean, out. Every, it's, everything is totally different than it was last year. The chemistry is more is everybody's together this yeah. year you know we got guys you know outside of football we all are kicking it together having a great time you know watching film and everybody's when we out here we got more guys than we have you know in recent years out here at the throwing sessions it's just fun everybody's competing having fun but at the same time out here being competitive so i mean i feel this you know way you no know, better put together than what last year do you feel like like when you get an opportunity to go home that you can kind of get to the point in a hurry where you kind of miss being here and being around your teammates and being being around FC? Yeah, I've been starting to feel that a lot since when I go home, you know, being that I've been around these guys and, you know, got relationships with them. I feel like I need to get back around here just to, probably just to work out and get back on campus, but that's how I feel. All right, well, hey, I know you're going to be one of the most highly anticipated players that uh, the fans look forward to uh, seeing play. Yes, sir. And uh, I'm not sure who's behind me right now, but... Yeah. Uh, Say something, happy quarterback. Birthday, say something. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, happy birthday to you. Oh, uh, thank you, man. Appreciate it. All right. Hey, thanks a lot. I appreciate right, you taking time with to talk to us.